Harley. I'm telling you, nothing beats the suspension on a Bronco. Yeah, I was thinking about getting me one of them new Tahoe. That's if they give it to me. Don't you tell me you're a Chevy man, boy. I don't know. I guess I haven't decided yet. We looked at this thing. Red line's about 6,000 RPM. It's like a fucking Ferrari, man. It's Tahoe? Shit. Tahoe is a housewife car. <laughs> Where the sun goes up and the sun comes down, nothing ever changes in the border town. Turns around and starts all over again. It's alcohol and nicotine, and every day's like Halloween. It's a movie, loco world we live in. Then. Shady deals, red hot cars, cold and steel, and every night temptation comes around. Down on the border where the coyotes howl, the hot legs blow in the big boys proud. Always some evil going down. Look out for you, don't lose control. Blow your cool, crush your soul. This truck's no license to drive like an asshole, Walt. Sorry about that, Sheriff. We didn't see you when he was coming over that hill there. Yeah, I noticed. Just uh, showing off some of my driving skills to Billy here. He's one of our new boys. And Ty put you in charge of him? Go figure, huh? Billy, meet the Sheriff. That's Sheriff Johnson. It's an honor to meet you, sir. Any relations to Chief Johnson? Yeah, Ty's my brother. Yep, you want to get anything done in Maverick County, these are the boys to know. Johnson family's been running this land since before the Alamo. Wow. Where are you boys headed? We got us an appointment with Timex. Uh, I want you to behave yourself out there, Walt. Oh, I will, Sheriff. You've ruined it. I don't need this shit. I can get a healthy worker. You heard me, old man. Get lost. Get lost. What about the years of work my father gave to this place? Years of loyalty. For what? For the pennies you pay him? Miranda, stop it. No, I will not. You have no heart. We may be poor Diamando, but we are not stupid. Uh, Senor Diamando, uh, she doesn't mean it. Uh, she's just a little angry. Uh, That's uh, what happens when you send your daughter to the university. She opens her eyes and gets ideas. If my father goes, so do I, and so does my mother. We will go too. Yeah, if he goes, we all go. Food is ready. Jack, come, come. You too, Lauro. Go ahead and sit. I'm coming. Mama, you never sit. Come, let me do it this time. Sit down, all of you, so we can say our prayer. Tengo hambre. Yo también. Yo también. <laughs> Thank you, God, for all that you have given us. A home food on the table, a dear family. Blessed are you, Jesus, and this food we are about to receive through your grace and through Christ our Lord. <gasps> Luciano, que paso? They're coming, Miranda, they're coming. They're looking for you. Who's coming? The soldiers. The soldiers? Oh my God. But, but why, what did I do? He said you were making trouble, Miranda. They want to take you in for questioning. Miranda, you want me to push you? No, no, you two, get back in the house. Go, before they see you two. Are you sure? Go. Okay, okay. Let's go, go, come go. On. Let's go. 
Quick, they're here. Siéntase, mamá. It's the soldiers. People, we don't want any trouble. It's okay, Mama. Come. What do you want with an innocent girl? I don't need to give you answers. You see this uniform? That is your answer. Now, where is she? What is her name? Lauro. You are a good little soldier, Lauro. So tell me, where, uh, where is Miranda? not here. She left. She didn't come to a dinner. Will you bring her back? We'll be back for her. stay here anymore. If they take you, Miranda, they'll never bring you back. You know what happened to the Gardella's son? We know that. We know what happened to I must leave this town. This whole country. No, mijita. No. Luciano. Jesus. Now is the time for us to go to America. America again, Miranda? Why? It is a great country, papa. People come from all over the world to America. I will be one of them. I will work hard and then send for all of you. Daughter, just stop dreaming. They don't want any more immigrants there. They look down on you. No, no, not Miranda. She speaks English so good. You and Mama, you will be so happy. We will have freedom. One hell of a shot, Sheriff. There must be terror in the hearts of Pepsi cans everywhere. <laughs> Can't remember last time we had to shoot for real, though. Yeah, well, we surprised old Denver in his house. Nobody wanted to shoot. You know, sometimes I don't feel like we're real cops. I mean... Border Patrol gets all the action around here. And when I talk to Hector in L.A., man, it's like a war zone out there every day. You wouldn't like it out there, Sanchez, trust me. Oh, yeah? Now, the women, on the other hand, oh, the women. Maybe we should take a trip out there sometime, together. We could stay with Hector. He knows all the right places. What do you say? 
Yeah, maybe after the election. Not much going on after that. Yeah, might be fun. Tonks will be coming over that hill any second, Billy. Tonks? Yeah, you know the West. Tonks, Tonk. It's the sound it makes when you hit him over the head with a flashlight. <laughs> well, here they come now. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, Walt, how you know that? Now, you see that boy in front there who's got the walking stick? Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, that's their coyote. Brings a bunch of them through that pass about three times a week. Call him Timex. How you, <laughs> you could set your watch by him. You gotta be kidding me. Why doesn't he just change his routine? Well, because uh, cause we got a little deal with him. That's why he uh, gets his pesos from the wets on the other side and he gets his dollars from us on this side. <laughs> Real bastard, huh? It's a good businessman, boy. Ready to rock and roll, rookie? I guess. You know, I can see it right now, headlines. First Johnson ever loses election in South Texas. Thanks, big brother. I'm trying to help. Well, I don't need the help. He won't win. He will win. You want to know why? Because his last name is Alvarez. Uh-huh, like our last name has never won us an election, huh? Is that well, what you're saying? Yeah, it wasn't because we were white. It was because we were good. Well, we're still good. Doesn't matter. Johnson's just another name now, and a common one, too. And sure as hell in Mexicano. Well, we always got the Mexican vote before. Well, the old ones we did. We knew Dad. He's the only white sheriff to ever give him a fair shake. New bunch. They only been here a couple of years. These Mexicans don't know about Dad. They don't know about Franny or Scarface Charlie. They don't know about Watson's watering hole. Hell, they never even heard of the McKinley Ranch. There's more on the way. It's not like the tide's gonna slow. No, you are a dying breed, baby brother. A white sheriff on the Mexico line. Why are we stopping? What is happening? I don't know. Why are we stopping? Okay! Give me all your money! We had a deal! I make a new deal now. You give me all your money and you live. Or what? You're gonna kill us all? No, Mama. No, we'll keep you alive for fun. Move your ass! Come on! Come on! Everybody out of the track! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! Hands on the air! Let's go! We had a deal. Your time will come. <laughs> Miranda. Vamanos. Miranda, let me, let me see you, okay? Yeah, see. Estoy bien. Que se vayan al infierno. <laughs> Hurry up, we're on the now. Hello. 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 What's the matter with you passing them out, boy? What kind of rook are you anyway? You don't teach them nothing down in Georgia. You got to start teaching them the practical stuff. <laughs> yeah, like handing out beer to their elders. Mm -hmm. Instead of watching El Norte 18 times, they show you that movie, Billy? Yeah, it was pretty good. <laughs> what a pile of horseshit, man. You think you can learn how to work the line off a movie? Nothing prepares you for the line. Right, we fighting a war out here, boy. And you on the front lines of it. Let's tell Frank where you're from. Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Mm. Fucking homie, you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> Why, you from Oklahoma, Franco? Yeah, I'm from Tucson. But I took Oklahoma on six and a half points. That's right, my longhorns raked them. Thank you very much. <laughs> What time is it? That's... What's the matter, Brady? 
You worry dollars gonna whip your butt for being in late? Yeah, I wish. I got a double shift tomorrow. I'm back on in six hours. I'll catch y'all later. Yeah. Bye, bro. They won't. I heard the new Tahoe's are gonna come in on time. Well, that's okay, because Billy here's got his heart set on a Bronco. Ain't that right, Bronco, Billy? Ain't no Broncos, neither. Yeah. Well, what is he gonna be doing on Friday night? Well, he's gonna be out at Eagle Pass with us, I guess. Well, what's an Eagle Pass? Looks like you're gonna find out, Bronco. Think up. Sorry. The others were right. Took you the wrong way. Ruth, you were right because look, going north will bring us closer to America. I tell you. Look, look, there's something up there. Parece un coche americano? Mira! Look, do you see that? I see it. I see it. Okay, look. I think we should try. No, 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 we can't do that. They'll see us for sure. Three of us. But one of us, one of us should try. I can't believe this. We said we would stick together. We told her parents we would protect her. We told them we'd get her to America, too. Luciano, Jesus is right. Look what happened to us. Everything changed now. We gotta do whatever we can. I ain't leaving without one last souvenir. <laughs> yep. Isn't that gorgeous? Mm-hmm. Gracias. It's uh, muy, muy bonito. Oh, si. Okay, darling, but this is surely the last thing we're going to buy today. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, mm -hmm. Gracias. Hurry, Miranda, before it's too late. Who are they? They're on their way to America. This is their last stop before Texas. You will follow me. Promise. In trouble or good, we are behind you. We'll see you soon. In America. <laughs> okay, now go. Go, go. Go, Miranda, go. Thank you, babe. <laughs> Thank you. De nada, señora. You want me to drive? No, no. Give me a couple more hours, and uh, you can take over. They're good people. I feel it. Sugar dumpling. Banana pie. <laughs> well, wake up, huh? It's gonna be a beautiful sunrise.
I'm gonna go get the camera. Here they come. Oh, Han, come here. Take a look at that. Looks like Border Patrol. Uh-huh. A little early morning excitement here. <laughs> Is that the big man? I talk to the big man. Nobody talks to him. I talk to him. Or no deal. Y'all put your weapons away. I'll send Las Armas. Yes. What are they doing? I don't know. Buddy? All right, I'm out. Are they killing people? All right, it's all right. I'm gonna reload. It's okay, honey. It's all right. They can't what see are they us. doing? It's all right. They don't see us up here. This time, Walt, you've gone too far. Oh my god. Let's go. Jim, I think we better get the hell out of here. Come on. Right. Here, grab the case, there. Grab the case. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on, baby. Take the camera. Take the camera. Boys, clean this up. I'll make sure a young boy stays honest. Come on, kid. Come on, let's go. Come on, move it.
Oh, they're the same man? I don't know. You I'm, saw him. I didn't I don't see know. him. I don't, you know, it might have been a drug deal. Who the hell knows? Yes, sir. What can I do for you? Why don't you step out of the vehicle, sir? Um, well, can I ask what the problem is, officer? Hmm? Oh! No! Buddy! 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 Oh, you can't. Buddy! Buddy! What did you do? Buddy! Man, Buddy! All you gotta do is tell us what you saw. We didn't see a thing. I guess we're just gonna have to take a minute for questioning. No! No, what are you doing this for? We didn't see anything. Mm hmm Hey, Billy, why don't you give me a hand here? Buddy, buddy, wake up, honey. Buddy! Oh. He's hurt. Oh. Buddy. You, uh, you want a way out here, Billy? Well, well, what are you going to do with them all? Oh, please. Why are you doing this to us, please? <laughs> Maybe I'll better keep watch. Yeah. Yeah, way out here. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Jesus Christ. Where do you get a look at this, Sheriff? Hey, boys, why don't you take a step backwards? Show a little respect for the dead. What do you think happened to the rest of his head? Set up your police line, deputy. Sanchez, you got your camera? Yeah. I want you to go back up on the road. See if you can find some tire tracks, huh? Danny. Oh, yes, sir. Who called it in? Oh, the old couple. Hi, folks. I'm Grant Johnson. Never County Sheriff's Office. Oh, how do you do it, Sheriff? My name is Rob, and this is my missus here. I have how a name. You, my name is Bess. Uh, Bess, how are you? How Good you to meet you. you. Now, I understand you folks found the bodies. Is that correct? Yep, 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 yep. yep. We was out hunting, and my dog, uh, Pooch, here, well, he found him just, just lying there. <laughs> he calls it hunting. But it's just walking, really. We never shoot him. Now, how long ago was that? Oh, that's a tough question, Chef. I think it's about, oh, I'd say about, about an hour or so ago. No, I yeah, really can't yeah. say, because we just don't wear watches when you're retired. Who uh, keeps track of uh, I'm afraid uh, that my dog might have licked up some of the blood. Is yeah. that right, baby? Look. Is that right, little girl? It's a bad dog. It's a bad dog. You don't you recognize either dog? victim, ma'am? You don't recognize either victim? The way they look? Could you? Uh-uh. Hey, Sheriff? Excuse me. Yeah, what do you got? Over here. Looks like fresh tracks. Those are fresh, all right. Looks like a four-wheel drive came right down through here. All right, mark this right here. Heistra, I want to lock this off right here, okay? be here. These people can't be here. This is a crime scene. Yeah, well, it looks like we don't have much of a choice now, does it, Sheriff? Coming through. Excuse me. Uh, uh, ladies hey. and gentlemen of the press, please hey, gather you around. Can't be there. Please gather around. Over here. Right. Thank you. Now, you see, this is exactly what I'm trying to tell you. The Sheriff's Department has been using outdated methods, outdated equipment, and, and outdated people, that's for sure. And I'm going to bring this to the Over light. Here. Hey, this is a crime scene. That means you. Now get back. All right? You want to take a picture? You got to go through me. Now get back. Heistra, Sanchez, get over here. Sheriff, have the victims been identified yet? No, I have no comment at this point. We just found the body. This is a crime scene. Please step back. Heistra! Man, you heard me. I have no information at this time. Sheriff Johnson, do you think this will affect your chances in Tuesday's election? People brutally murdered right over there. This isn't about any goddamn election. Now get back. How much does it cost? How much you have? Twenty dollars each. Twenty dollars. <laughs> Amigos, your OTM. What do you mean by OTM? Other than Mexican. <laughs> TMs get caught by the migra. And they're back home on a plane faster than you can shake shit. You gotta make sure you can make it, amigos. Some uh, OTMs pay five, ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand? We only have twenty. Empty. <laughs> I'm a businessman, amigo. I have to make money. I have people to support. Come on, mister. They said you could help us. Maybe. 
Who just grossed you, sir? Well, I was saying I'm gonna head up to San Antonio tomorrow. Check out those people's backgrounds, see if I can make some sense of this whole deal. What about the election? That's not looking too good right now. These murders might be just what Alvarez needs to push him over the top. What are you gonna do about it? You know something, big brother? What I've been realizing? Without this job, I ain't got nothing. This little piss ant house. No family. You always got us. Kids, they love you. You know Margaret. Well, yeah, that's your family, Ty. Yeah, I got nothing. I've never built nothing, I haven't created nothing. It's like I've been married to this damn job and this community my whole life, and now they want a divorce. You don't have to lose this election, Grant. It's not too late. Listen, I just need you to help me find out who killed those people. That's the only help I need right now, all right? You're gonna get it. But who knows how long that's gonna take. Election's on Tuesday. Let me make the phone calls I need to make. I'll get the vote out for you. What do you suppose old daddy would say if he was alive right now? What would dad say? God damn it, Grant, would you quit idolizing dad? He's into more shit than you can ever imagine. You're just too young to know about it. Yeah, that's real nice. I can't believe I'm hearing you say that. Quit being so goddamn naive. Dad did whatever was necessary to stay in power. Well, he didn't break any goddamn laws. I know that much. Bullshit. Dad was above the law. He sure as hell wasn't going to let some Mexican car dealer kick him out of office. Now, you listen to me. You don't have to do a damn thing. I'll take care of it, all right? All right. looking for someone. Well, this is my diner. Who are you looking for? My cousin Raul. I heard he was working here. Raul. I don't know any Raul. He's not so tall. Straight, dark hair. He speaks a little English. Maybe you mean Joaquin. Yes, Joaquin. Joaquin. We call him Raul because it's his middle name. Joaquin left about a month ago for California. Is he coming back? I don't think so. Did he know you were coming? No, not really. Huh? Sorry. Sorry. Maybe you need someone to work in the place of... in the place of... Uh, Joaquin. Joaquin. What did I say? Hey, slow down, mister. The boy can't keep up. Well, you stay with him if you want. Watch out for the skinhead. Skinheads? What skinheads? Uh, you know. They're fighting a holy war for the white race. They like it up here, uh, this time of day. Like, uh, how do you chickens with, uh, high-powered rifles? Boom! <laughs> Check this out. Scared the shit out of the wet, boy. Oh, yes. Amiga! 
¡La vida! ¡Córrele! ¡Córrele! in that TV set. Oh, or is it that Sheriff Johnson you're interested in? <laughs> now there is one tough catch. I'll tell you. All the good women at Crystal City been chasing that one for years. Not one of them's got a ring yet. Oh, order's up. Thanks, Javier. Honey, come on, more coffee. Miranda. I want to ask you, you've been here a long time. Six years. If, if you knew something, you know, you saw something you shouldn't see, something bad, would you tell the police? What did you see? It doesn't matter what. Would you trust the police? Miranda, you're illegal here, verdad? Si. If you talk to the police, they're gonna make your life hell. They're not gonna leave you alone. They're gonna take you to court and make you talk. Y pa qué? So they can send you back. <laughs> no, mija. You do your work. Y recuérdate. In this country, every man is for himself. Hey. 
sure? Hey, Gene, how's it going? Hey, hey, Sheriff. Hey, Loretta. Let me have the regular with a glass of water, please. Hey, sir, the RV? Nope. How about the helicopter? Last I heard, still up there. Yeah. Neighbors see anything? Nothing. It's a goddamn 50 foot RV. Don't make any sense. Somebody saw something. Hey, Sheriff. Get a little of that new girl. Yeah, I saw her. See this? Page three. Page three. Here you go, sugar. There you go. Thank you, Loretta. Mm -hmm. County Supervisors back Alvarez. Just four days before the election, the Maverick County Supervisors announced their support for local car dealer Richard Alvarez in the race for sheriff. Council's endorsement is seen as a lethal blow to incumbent Sheriff Grant Johnson. Well, the same to you, County Supervisors. Could you have the new girl wait on us, please? Mr. Sanchez here would really appreciate it. I'm not good enough for y'all anymore, Sheriff. No, you're too good. Uh, you're too good. Yeah, whatever. Thank you. <laughs> hey, listen to this. The Sheriff's Department relies on outdated equipment, outdated methods, and outdated people. Sheriff, you're going to have to answer this guy. Yeah, you should make a speech or something. Let me tell you something. I don't have to bullshit these people. I've been in this town a long time. They know what I'm about. Listen, Grant. People that know you and knew your father, they're loyal. You're forgetting how many new people are here and how many friends are gone. And how if this murder happened back in your dad's day, <laughs> the whole community would pull together. But nowadays, everybody keeps to themselves. It's okay, don't worry about it. Loretta, right, you know, it's my fault. You know, we'll be right back to take your order, all right? All right, okay. come on, honey. Listen, listen to me. I told you they are not immigration, okay? So you are just gonna have to trust some people in your life, all right? Even if they have a gun, for God's sake. All right, look, you know what? You just go take care of yourself. I'll, I'll deal with them, okay? All right. All right. Sheriff, sorry about that. Can I take your all's order here? Yeah, we're ready, Loretta, but I still want the new girl to help us. Well, you know what? Her English is just not so good, so I'll... Her English is just fine. Loretta, please, go get her. <sighs> yes, sir. I want you to take it, honey. Hello. I'm Grant Johnson. This is Jimmy Hydstra. And this... This fine young man here, this is Danny Sanchez. What's your call? We come here all the time. And your name is? I'm Miranda. Miranda? Miranda. Well, that's 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 a very beautiful name. Uh, Mira, to see, right? The one who saw. Promising campaign of Richard Alvarez for Maverick County Sheriff. Federal tax officials launched an investigation into allegedly fraudulent tax returns filed by three of Alvarez's six South Texas car dealerships. Mr. Alvarez released a statement denying the affair with the housekeeper and reassuring the community that he would be absolved of all wrongdoing in the investigation by the Internal Revenue Service. Nevertheless, Maverick County supervisors quickly withdrew their endorsement of Mr. Alvarez in the race for sheriff, suddenly leaving incumbent sheriff Grant Johnson in excellent position to reclaim the seat that he and his family have controlled for over 30 years. Johnson has been struggling to overcome his waning popularity in the face of increasing violence in the county. Highlighted by last weekend's bloodshed, 
You remember uh, Sheriff Johnson, don't you, Billy? I sure do. How you doing, Sheriff? Good, Billy. I'm doing good. You been out to the old McKinley Ranch? McKinley Ranch? Um, I, I don't know. Well, we found some tire tracks out there right where we found those bodies. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Looks like a Bronco might have passed through. Oh, well, Sheriff, you got it all wrong. I mean, I... Billy, I... Billy, it's all right. Sheriff's not accusing you of nothing. I mean, uh, he's not the only Bronco passing through that area. Sheriff knows that. Our boys are out there all the time. Just not last night. Of course, we've been uh, working out that Eagle Pass bus for quite a while now, you know. Can I ask you something, Billy? You see anything strange last night? Well, yeah, I seen something real strange. I never seen nothing like that before in my whole life. All that shooting and all. But... It's like I told you, Sheriff. None of my boys seen nothing, but uh, I'd be happy to keep checking into it for you. Good luck in the election, Sheriff. What the hell's the matter with you? Can't keep your goddamn mouth shut. I'm sorry, Walt. I was just trying to answer his question the best I could. Oh, Mr. Harmon. I fell asleep a few minutes before you come. Miranda, why didn't you tell me you had no place to stay? I have a place. I'm just tired. Don't lie to me, Miranda. Yeah, can't have my employees with no place to sleep. I mean, where are you going to take a shower and all? Do I smell bad, Mr. No, Harmon? No, no, you know what I mean. Mr. Harmon, I, I'm going to find a place. I promise. I just need my first money. All right. I'll give you an advance today. But I want an address from you right away, you understand? Yes, sir. Right away. What about that new kid? Uh, what's his name? Billy Mercer. Yeah, Billy. Well, he's doing all right, I guess. I mean, uh, you know, all things considered. Are you sure? Gets this funny look in his eyes sometimes, like he's thinking too much. I think it was a mistake to take him up to Eagle Pass. Ty, boy's riding in my truck. We was gonna have to clue him in sooner or later. Well, is he with us or not? I don't think the boy's made up his mind yet. Oh, that by God is not gonna flush. That boy cracks, we're all going down. What do you want me to do about it? Does everyone from your country speak as well as you? No. Pero para mí fue muy importante aprender inglés. I'm sorry if I sound mad at you, but you know, people in my country, they study, they shower, they have a phone, even if they are poor people. Well, I'm sorry I didn't mean to offend you. 
since I come here. Everybody tell me, you are so pretty, you are so clean, you speak English so good, like it's not normal. Did you learn to speak English in Guatemala? I study, study hard. I read every, every English newspaper. I went to the university. I didn't finish, but I took classes, and there were a lot of American students. Well, why didn't you finish? I had to help my family. I went back to work in the factory. I wanted to study. I wanted to, to finish the university, to study the law. Law? In my country, freedom and justice are only words. So when I come here, I thought in the United States, it will be different. But you don't like cops, right, Policia? With them, I don't have such a good experience. Do you like to be a cop? Cop? I don't know, it's uh... You know, it's all I've ever known. I mean, my, my whole family's been in law enforcement ever since I can remember. Do you have a family? Do I have it? Yeah, I have a family. Why are you so surprised? You come to eat here always. <laughs> no, I have a brother. He lives in Del Rio. He's got a wife, a bunch of little kids. Yeah, he was a sheriff before me. And your mama and papa? My mom passed away. My dad, well, um, my dad was a sheriff in this county a long time ago. It was back when being a Texas lawman still meant something. He died on the job, trying to break up a fight between a drunk and his wife. Took a stray bullet in the head for his trouble. That's not much of a death for a hero. the marrying kind. I don't think they know. Can I help you? Uh, yeah, is uh, Sheriff Johnson here? You sit over there at the counter. Oh, he was. Maybe he went in the back. Grant, there's a guy over there who wants to talk to you. Some kid I never saw him before. Hey, what do you think if I want you home, huh? My home? There, there are a lot of people in my home right now. No, no, I, I didn't mean I'd 
go inside, I mean, I'll just walk you to the door. And... Will that be all right? Okay. So this is it, huh? This is where you live, your home? Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Johnson. Call me Grant, please. Good night, Grant. Hey, listen, uh, I'm not a very good cook, but why don't you come over Wednesday night and I'll make dinner for you. Pick you up at the diner. Okay. Yes, I come. Okay. Good night. Good night. On your mind, Billy. Nothing. Come on, boy, speak up now. It's just. I didn't think it was going to be like this, Walt. <clears throat> well, nobody thought things were going to turn out the way they did, Billy. Doesn't seem right. I mean, not for me at least. I, I don't. I don't know. I think I gotta get out of here. You know, start on something different. You know, go back to Oklahoma, get my head straight. Let me tell you something. There ain't no getting out of it. Okay, you was there. You was part of it. You saw the killing, and now you part of it for good. What are we doing here, Walt? It's a surprise, Billy. Well, I don't think I like surprises too much. So what do you think? About what? About your new vehicle. <laughs> Looky there, boy. That's a brand new Chevy Tahoe, is it not? <laughs> you, you, you gotta be kidding me, right? Hell if I am. Isn't that what you wanted? Come on. I tell you, Billy, things ain't all that bad, boy. <laughs> right? Let's do it. Let's go for a ride. Come on. All right. All right. <laughs> I still say you should have gone for a Bronco. Yeah, hello. But your brother. What's up, Ty? Now, I just called to tell you you can get a good night's sleep tonight. Lectures tomorrow, it's all taken care of. Jesus, Ty, I don't want to hear about that. God, would you relax? Look, I just want you to know that the Johnsons still run this county. You too. Let's go, both of them. 
Come on. Miranda got on. No, no, it can't be. I'm telling you, man, it's el mismo. Sheriff, there's a radio call from the Border Patrol. Put it through. Yeah, go ahead. Sheriff, it's Wall. I think we might have spotted that RV of yours. You know the old dirt road off of Highway 41, about two miles east of the county line? You reading me, Sheriff? Yeah, we copy that. We're on our way. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna check the barn. Go. Hello? Hello? Is anybody here? Hello? Buenos dias. Is anybody here? Hello? There's no one in the barn. Look, her stuff is here. You can't take those shoes. Necesitamos ropa. We need the clothes. They'll never miss it. Something doesn't feel right, though. I mean, we, we gotta get out of here. Come on. Okay, okay. Espérame, espérame. Jesus, come on, rápido. Look, there's food in here. Okay, just bring it with you. Come on. Let's go, rápido. Oh, that grandma, no? Oh, oh, run! 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 We just took some food. We just took some food. Hey, hey, hey. That's enough, Heistro. That's enough. What's the matter with you? The arm sent you? No, sir. You just check that. Look. No, that's not it's ours. That's impossible. Hey. What? That's not ours? That's, that's impossible. What? Hey, ¿Dónde están ustedes? Somos de Guatemala. We're political refugees. And then where'd you get the gun? I swear, mister, that gun does not belong to us. Yeah, right. It's not ours. <laughs> ah. Hey, Billy, you hear about the, uh, <laughs> the wetback who got the job in the East Texas sawmill? Nope. Well, uh, first day at work, wet loses a finger, right? Boss comes up to him and says, How'd you do that, Wet says? Well, I, I stole my finger in the spinning wheel like this here, see? Oh, no, I did it again! <laughs> <coughs> hey, Billy, come on now. Take it easy on the nose candy, man. I think you're starting to like that too much. Wow. <laughs> okay. So, uh, what do you call a thousand wetbacks jumping out of an airplane? A good fucking star! Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, oh. <laughs> How many wet bags does it take to change a light bulb? How many? They ain't got none! <laughs> Almost ready. 
Is this your car? Yeah. It's a Pontiac GTO 64. It's a classic. Americans love big cars. Well, I love that car. Longest relationship I've ever had. But why is it here? It's uh, marking a poem that I like. Mario Benedetti. Yeah, right. Do you know him? Yes. I love him. He's one of the best. Tactica mia strategia. Tactic and strategy. Hey, can you say the whole poem in English? Will help me learn. Uh, maybe. <laughs> My tactic is to look at you, to learn. Learn. The way you are, to love you the way you are. My tactic is to talk to you, to build with, to build with words an indestructible bridge. My, my tactic is to be honest and to know that you are honest and that, what's that? And that we, uh, we don't sell. And that, and that, thank you. And that we, we don't sell lies to each other so that between us there won't be a curtain or a chasm. My strategy is. Mi estrategia es que, es que un día, día cualquiera, cualquiera, no sé cómo, sé cómo ni sé con qué, qué texto, pretexto, por, por fin, fin me necesitas. Mexican lady downtown that makes them. Huh? How is your um, investigation about your murder case? Well, it's a tough one. Nobody saw anything. I saw their daughter on TV. It's very sad. But you will find some, you will find the truth for her, right? Well, yeah, not just for her, but for everyone. It's my job. You will find witnesses. You're real concerned about this, aren't you? Well, I, I bring more stuff from the not here. You're not a waitress here. I can't. Did that hurt you? No. Uh, what is it? I... What I'm, is it, Miranda? Please, you've got to trust me. I saw it. You saw what? The murder. 
I saw everything. I was there. I was hiding. I was... I, I was gonna tell you before believe me I wanted yeah, but I was too afraid. Down. Wait, you were... Uh, you, you saw what? You were hiding where? What? Uh, I was with the husband and the wife. The Randalls? Yes. I was in the big... the big truck. I was hiding in the back. We all saw it. And, and, and the killers, they came in and they took the husband and the wife and they killed them. Who did it? But they didn't see me. They were... they were... La Migra. La Migra. Did you get a close look at them? Did you see their faces? Well, there was one man. He came in the back where I was. He came to take the camera. And I saw him. I saw his right arm like that. And he had a tattoo. A tattoo? Yes. A tattoo of a snake and a knife. In the name of God, you must believe me. It was La Migra. All right. You stay here. Margaret, this is Granis Towers, sir. You know it can't wait, Margaret. Please go get him. Until this case is solved, everybody's a suspect. Currently, members of the Maverick County Sheriff's Department are bringing in two men for questioning the Crystal City homicide. Who are you now, rushing off to, Miranda? It's very clear Mr. these Harmon, two men have not I'm been accused of murder. I cannot work here anymore. Thank you for everything you did for me. But I must go. On one of them. Yes, that is wait, 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 wait. No Please tell me uh, what's wrong so maybe I could be of some help. Now, the two men we're bringing in for questioning are brothers from Guatemala. It's our understanding that they entered the country illegally. Um, their names are Jesus and Luciano Diaz. That concludes my no. comment. Impossible, no. What the hell you want with this place, Billy? Copper joint. Hey, Walt. Yeah. I got something real important to tell you. What's up? I I, I know I should have gone and told you before I, I... Well, spit it out, boy. Well, you remember that night? Now when those people, those people died? When Briggs died, Billy. Yeah, well, when Briggs died. But well, when I went back and cleaned up in the barn, I saw some girl get out of that RV. You're shitting me. Uh, I, I, I think she saw everything, too. Are you a crazy son of a bitch? And that girl, she she works here. She's a waitress here in this diner. Trust me, get in the car, that girl's please. illegal, Sheriff. It's my job to deport her. No, you can't deport her. She's a witness for the state. You can't deport her until she testifies. <laughs> testifies for what? Don't worry, you'll be there in handcuffs. Is that right? You will arrest me, Sheriff? 
That's funny. You can't do that. You can't do nothing. You ain't nothing but Ty Parker's little brother, buddy. You wouldn't even be sheriff if he didn't fix the electric. You think this is a game? Huh? You think this is a goddamn game? You're wrong. You can't do whatever you want. You're fucking with the wrong people, Johnson. You can end up more dead than your old man, buddy. Game's over, Walt. <laughs> it ain't over, Grant! Give me the cheat. Be safe here, but you gotta promise me that you're not gonna leave. No matter what, you don't leave this room, all right? Promise me. Will you come back? Well, of course I'll come back. What do you think I'm gonna leave you here? I gotta talk to my brother. Now look, here's the keys. He killed people for nothing, for nothing. What? Just... What? He's gonna kill me? He's my brother. But how can you trust him? Hey, I'll be fine. All right, now you stay right here. All right, promise me. Okay. Lock that door behind me. Now he's alone. She's not with him. people to get that diamond just ring keep it quiet. You leave my family out of this. They don't need to be hearing this. You want to talk? Let's go. up, Grant. Make something of yourself. Think about a new house, a new car. A new car. Is it that important to you, huh, to kill people? Is it that important? They were Mexican drug runners we killed. Scum of the damn earth. Yeah, what about the two people, those two good old people in that RV, huh? What'd they do? It's just wrong time, wrong place. I couldn't risk everything. Dignity, respect, loyalty, doing the right thing. What, what the hell does that get you? You slave away day in, day out. You get nothing while the scumbags get rich. Grant, you know the drugs are coming in. No matter what we do, we can't stop it. Why shouldn't we cash in on it, huh? Dad were here right now. If yeah. Dad were here, he would do the same damn thing. If somebody encroached on his territory, if Dad would never take out one of his own. Never! Oh, yeah? 
How do you think Scarface Charlie died? Just like Dad said he No, not like Dad said! Pop sent him in first. And backed him up till he was too late. What are you saying, huh? You saying Dad's a murderer? Is that what you're saying? He's murder. It's self-preservation. God damn it. I don't want to hurt you. Hell, you can't hurt me. Hell, you wouldn't even be sure if it wasn't for me. I got you elected. It's payback time. I you never asked you to do that. Quit acting so noble, so goddamn innocent. You know exactly what I was doing. You never even tried to stop me. Yeah, well, I'm stopping you now. Grant, man, think about what you're doing, man. Are you gonna disgrace the whole family? Get your stink off me. You already disgraced the family. You turned out to be a real sorry son of a bitch, you know that time, partner. I got the same mom and the same dad as you do. Yeah, but you ain't my brother. You ain't my brother no more. Necessary, he'll come out on his own.
Towers Parker Johnson, you're under arrest. You gonna arrest your own brother? I can't believe you're gonna do that. You're giving me no choice. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney if you cannot afford an attorney. Court appoints you one at present. For question. The attorney will be appointed to you no charge. Yeah. Yeah, could you hold on one second, please? Phone call for you. For me? Yeah. Yeah, I got him right here. Hold on. Hello? Miranda! <laughs> Luciano! You saved our lives! We're free, Miranda! We're free! We'll see you soon! Si, estamos aquí, Luciano! Yeah. I will see you soon! You may kiss the bride. With this rope, it's a symbol of a bond between a man and his wife. Take this. By binding you together, it symbolizes the perfect union. And it is my prayer that it should never, ever be broken. <laughs> Bravo. Try again. 